Hey y'all, it's Alex with ALX Rods, and I wanted to share a conversation that I had with one of our customers uh, yesterday, and it's an awesome conversation. He called us to talk about spinnerbait rods, and uh, spinnerbaits have gotten really hot lately. Uh, a lot of publicity around them. It's got guys throwing them a little bit more, so we're having a lot of questions about spinnerbait rods and, and the right rod selection. So. Uh, it's important to know how you're using your spinner baits, what you're doing with them, because there's anything from a quarter ounce willow leaf all the way up to an ounce, ounce and a half, two ounce ledge buster type spinner bait. Totally different techniques, totally different styles, totally different rods. So uh, it's real important that we ask those questions and find out what are you doing with your spinner bait, how are you fishing it. And uh, this customer, he's probably like 75% of us. He's throwing a 38 or three eighths to a, a half ounce, something like a Nichols Pulsator. And uh, he's, uh, he's chunking and winding, he's around docks, he's around cover. And uh, so we, we made a few recommendations for him, and, um, or I did, and, and I wanted to uh, just share those with you. And uh, one of the favorite rods, if you're on open points, if you're on uh, going down banks, cruising along, just kind of open water. I like the seven foot one medium heavy Deputy. It's a Narzolo series. Uh, it's got a longer handle for a two-handed cast. Um, it, it lets you have perfect hand placement to really get some good leverage on a good cast. And uh, the longer length and power give you a really good hook set, especially when that fish charges up behind a spinnerbait and uh, rushes you a little bit. So you can reel real fast, but you also have a little bit more rod in there to pick up that slack in the line. Uh, if you're in a different scenario where you're kind of like this customer, where you're uh, uh, throwing around docks, you're throwing around trees, I like the 6.6 Mitch in the Zolo series. Uh, it's got a short handle for underhand roll casts, which help you shoot, um, shoot uh, spinner baits up underneath docks, kind of a, a sniper spinner bait type situation. And uh, it's got a real fast tip on it, uh, a little bit faster than the Deputy. And uh, it's also got a little bit more backbone the whole way through. Now it's a medium plus, but it, it does a really good job up to about a half ounce spinner bait. Um, so it, it, it really is good for that close cover work. Definitely has enough backbone to get a fish out of cover. Uh, if you need something in between, you're doing a lot of different stuff, you're around some docks, you're around some trees, you're around different things, I'd go with the 6.9 Rosa. Um, it's a good mix in between. A little bit shorter handle, you can still do a roll cast. Uh, if you're tipped down a lot with it, you're, uh, you're not gonna be splashing the water as much um, with the 6.9 because you've got a little bit shorter rod. This rod also pulls some very good double duty with a few other techniques. So uh, the, the 6.9 is kind of an in-between. So just to kind of sum up what we would recommend, I like the seven foot one Zolo Deputy. It's a medium heavy for open situations, points, cruising down banks. And if you're around cover, I like the six foot six Mitch, which is uh, in our Zolo series as well. Short handle for roll casts and uh, plenty of power to pull the fish out of cover. So if you have any questions, post them below. What kind of spinner baits do you fish and where do you fish them? Post your comments below and let's get some spinner bait talk going.